Okay, I'm going to show you how to add a Google custom search box to your website in just a couple of minutes. Uh, so we're starting out right here with my website, which is just whiz.com. And as you can see, there's no search functionality going on uh, right now. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to head over to google.com slash web elements, which just launched today. And I'm going to try adding a custom search element. And I just tried doing this for the first time a few minutes ago. And uh, now I'm going to recreate it for you uh, in real time just to show you how easy it is. Uh, by default, it just searches your own site. So it's just doing a site search. And so since we don't need to change anything, I'm just going to go ahead and select and copy this code as is. I don't even need to specify what my site name is. And I'm going to head back to my text editor here and just paste in the code, hit save. I'm going to go back to the browser, back to my site, and refresh. And boom, the, the uh, search box is right there. Um, and this is all set to go right now. Uh, but actually, it's right now it's filling the, as you can see, 100% of, of the page here. Um, and so I'm going to go back to the text editor and hack it up a little bit. I'm going to limit it to, I think, 500 pixels instead of 100%. Hit save again, back to the browser, and refresh. And that looks a lot better, and that way when I you know resize the window, it won't get uh, super big. And this is to show you that it's working right now because my site's already indexed. I can search for, you know, every time I mention Wawa. And boom, there it is. It's that easy.